Alfred Scott rides his bike along the I-10 service road in Westlake Forest every day to work. I pay attention. Even though I know cars don't pay attention, they don't give me no respect. So I'm trying my best to pay attention and stay out of their way. And every day, he would see a woman in a wheelchair being pushed by a man along the same stretch. I used to see them all the time. He used to be pushing her up and down the service road, though. Every day? Just about every day. Scott learned while the man was pushing the woman in her wheelchair just before 6 Monday night near Bundy Road on the Iten service road, they were hit from behind by this white Honda Accord, according to the NOPD. The 39-year-old woman died, and the 43-year-old man had minor injuries. She was a sweet little lady, and she come out here, she had talk while her boyfriend go in the store and get a cold drink. Daryl Williams works at Sam's Meat Market, where the victim often shopped for groceries, according to employees. I have told her, I said, y'all need to get out the highway. Y'all going to get hit. But they don't have no other choice. Along this stretch where the woman was hit, you can see different pieces of bumpers and car parts. And we don't know if they're all connected to the incident. But neighbors who live and work around here say this can be a dangerous stretch because there's such poor lighting at night. To hear about her accident was very sad because I know these roads are very dark. I drive them every night. I have to get into the second lane just because I see other people walking because there's no sidewalk, there's no lights. And everybody from the neighborhood, which we're a low-income neighborhood, has to walk. Employees here say many of their customers walk that same stretch. They need lights. They, need, they really need lights. I either put a pedestrian walk. That may not be the first or last until the city put up some lights or some sidewalk. New Orleans police are asking for help finding the driver. They shared this video of the white Honda Accord and say it will have damage to the right side and a damaged or missing side view mirror. Erica Ferrando, Eyewitness News.